People selling medicine and making unfounded medical claims is a crime as old as medicine itself. And it's the job of the FDA's Office of Criminal Investigation to stop those criminals from defrauding patients and potentially hurting them. Recently, a naturopathic physician was convicted for the third time of selling medicine not approved by the FDA using completely unsubstantiated health claims. His Dynamic Duo product was touted on social media. The seller claimed it could treat over 100 viral, bacterial, fungal, and parasitic infections. Not surprisingly, no such drug has been through either safety or effectiveness testing at the FDA. An FDA special agent went undercover communicating with the seller ordering his medicine, and then getting it lab tested. Turns out, this is the third conviction for Rick Marshall. And yet he still tried to appeal that by saying the government failed to prove he knew his product labeling was false. Well, on appeal, the court said there's no need to prove that a criminal knows their drug labeling is false. If this is the third time you're being prosecuted for this crime, that also kind of seems like a weak defense to me, but well, what do I know? Our friend will be spending eight months in prison, which seems like a light sentence, but frankly, I'll take it. More importantly, you should give thanks to the tiny Office of Criminal Investigations at the FDA for protecting your elderly parents from being defrauded by people like this. If you have a tip for them about someone selling unapproved medicine, report the activity at this URL on the screen.